Hello, everybody. We are back here on Call of the Wild, the Angler. And as you can see, I have officially found a crazy good walleye spot. So let's go ahead and cast out. What I'm using right now is a size three spinner. Uh, let's check it. Let's check the rod and reel and everything as well. This is the whip it. This is one of the free rods you get in the classic tackle pack. And then we've got the muckle casting reel. We've got 19 pound fluorocarbon. And yes, our uh, size three spinner. This has been working pretty well for me, and this particular location seems to be just an absolute hot spot. And uh, once we reel this in, we'll go ahead and take a look at where this location actually is, because it's pretty insane. There has been an absurd amount of walleye here, and they seem to be very aggressive, and that's a big one. This might be a big gold, potentially even a diamond. Let's see what we got here. This is definitely on the larger size or the uh, larger end of the size that they can reach. From what I've seen, there we go. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good walleye right there. Pull him up here. And there we go. What a start to the video. A gold 11.51 pound walleye. That is beautiful. You love to see it, man. And so does, so does our guy. He, uh, <laughs> he looks like he's really loving to see it. But anyway, this location is actually pretty easy to find. It's just right here. Uh, basically, just fast travel to here or here and then run over to this little uh, mouth of the river where it kind of transitions into this little uh, pond or lake or whatever you want to call it. This is a walleye hotspot and best results are going to be at night, of course, because this is a uh, nocturnal fish for the most part. You can catch them in the day, but you're going to catch a lot more of them at night. And uh, ever since it became like dusk we have seen a lot of crazy walleye action to the point where i just had to make this video there we go we got another one on okay that that's definitely a diamond that one is definitely a diamond walleye he is fighting insanely hard way harder than that gold was fighting is that a lake trout right here it's a lake trout are you kidding me are you kidding me? All this for an average size lake trout. That is crazy. Or, yeah. <laughs> Man, that's actually kind of unfortunate. But, I mean, it is what it is. On that note, let's go ahead and take a look at the diamond walleye that we ended up catching uh, shortly before starting this video. Oh my gosh, is that... Oh, that looks huge. That looks like a monster. That might be a diamond walleye. Oh my gosh. That looks like a diamond walleye. Or at least a really big gold. That is huge. I have only caught one walleye at this point. Obviously, that's not going to be in this video as I caught it when I was not recording. But this guy right here, I saw him surfacing. And I had to cast out and try to get him. I didn't get a very good look the first time. So I wasn't sure how big he actually was, and when he went for it right there, it was pretty clear that that guy is a giant. So let's hope that it is a diamond. He is putting up a major fight. Let's get him in here. That is huge. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this guy very well could be a diamond. Come on. Oh, he's pushing away. He's getting away. There we go. There we go. And we have landed him. Please be a diamond. It's a diamond. Let's go. 16 pound diamond walleye. Our first diamond of the new update. And we got ourselves a nice little diamond token to go along with it. Let's go. That is an incredible first diamond to get on this brand new update. I am incredibly happy about that. Well, let's hope that in the future we can avoid uh, hooking into those lake trout like that. I'd like it if we could just end up getting uh, some walleye. That's, uh, that's really all we're after is those walleye. And I think because of that run-in we just had with the lake trout, we're going to go to our big uh, casting rod, maybe have a little bit of uh, better luck with getting them in if we happen to hook a lake trout. There we go. We finally got another walleye going for it. I had to go to a size 5 spinner. I guess there's just nothing big enough in this spot anymore to catch uh, stuff on the 3. I'm assuming size 3 spinner is going to be gold and diamond only. 
but uh, size 5 will get the silvers, it seems. And there we go, we got another walleye on, finally. Let's see what this guy ends up being. Uh, looks like it's actually not a walleye. Is that a rainbow trout? I think it's a rainbow trout. No, it's a little tiny lake trout. <laughs> Man, we keep getting the lake trout while we're trying to get the walleye. Yeah, I mean, it's not too big of a deal, though. We get a lot of money for the lake trout, so... Can't be too mad about it, either. There we go, we got another fish on. Let's see what this one ends up being. I think that one is a walleye. It was going way too fast for a lake trout, I think, but I could be wrong. Yeah, I'm wrong. What do you know? Another lake trout. <laughs> we are getting so many of these. Oh, there we go. I did not even see the fish going for it. That is uh, one of the things that has just been changed with this update. That is... Whoa, 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 whoa. We got a sturgeon. Wait, we got a sturgeon. Oh my gosh, we got a shovel nose sturgeon. I thought that would be a walleye. I did not know the sturgeon were in this little spot. That is awesome. You love to see it, man. I think we got another sturgeon going for it, it seems. Yep, we got another one on. So uh, we have tried to get walleye and in turn found a really nice uh, sturgeon spot as well. I think something's going for it, possibly. I saw the bobber dip down slightly. There we go. We got a fish on. And once again, another sturgeon. Well, this has gone from a uh, walleye video to a walleye and sturgeon video, which, hey, I'm not mad about that. I'm glad that I finally uh, found where they are. There we go. We got another walleye on, and that looks to be a half-decent one as well. Of course, the second I go back to the spinners and put on a smaller spinner than what I've been using, we get a pretty decent one. Yeah, that was almost a gold. That was definitely really close to being gold, but not quite. Looks like we've got another one going for it. This one much smaller than the last one, but still another walleye. And that is what we are after today, so it's good to see them going for it. This guy will definitely be much, much smaller, though. Question is, is it a big silver or a small, or a big uh, bronze or small silver? Ah, uh, it's just a bronze. 2.60 pounds. Another little guy darting after it. There we go. I guess all we had to do was just move to the opposite side of the pond, and now we've managed to catch three of them within a very short amount of time. Is that a rainbow trout? I think it is. Well, we're about to find out. Sure looks like either a uh, rainbow or potentially an orid. Yeah, it's a rainbow trout. Well, as the uh, sun begins to rise, our time fishing for walleye starts to end. Thank you guys so much for watching. This... What the? <laughs> Wait. Oh! It's because I looked up. Well, I just completed a photo challenge accidentally. That's hilarious. As I was saying, thank you guys for watching. This was a fun video. We got ourselves a diamond walleye, as well as catching a few shovel-nosed sturgeon for the first time ever. So thank you for being here. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing if you're enjoying the content. And also, if you haven't already, hit that like button on the way out and leave a comment before you leave as well. I will see you all in the next one. Peace.